morning y'all hope you hope you're feeling fabulous today i wanted to chat a little bit about grief this morning and how our body might experience it how we cope with it and just do a little bit of balance around it it's been a, a big month for me personally and i'm not talking about all the big stuff going on in the planet this is all just really uh close stuff so because i'm an irish background obviously st patty's day is always well you know we always have a guinness let's face it um but anyway so i try to celebrate the irish my dad never made it to uh ireland he was 44 years old when he died of no known cause so they put it down to atherosclerosis which is a build-up of cholesterol in the ar arteries and of course, he was an alcoholic. He had, uh, he was a smokeaholic. <laughs> he sort of uh, smoked three packets a day. He drank until he was totally blotto every night. He did work till the day he died. And another, but he only died at 44 years old. But my three siblings, sorry, oh, yeah, I'm starting to feel it. So my three siblings, very much uh, along the lines of they were waiting until they hit 44 because, oh, actually they all waited till they hit 22 as well. So I was uh, 20 when he died. So my two oldest siblings, they were both relieved when they, you know, they already hit that mid midlife <laughs> crisis by being older than 22. But anyway, so on St. Paddy's Day, I got news from my mum that there were all sorts of um, spots in her body and that it didn't sound very good. And I'm like, hey, we don't know anything yet. Just relax, you know. Anyway, but that was on St. Paddy's Day. So I was on my way to the pub. They didn't have any dark beer. I started crying. I thought, well, this can't be about the beer. <laughs> you know, so uh, anyway. So, but then April's always big for me because dad died on Good Friday. It was Good Friday, the 13th of April. So therefore, whenever I'm thinking about dad in April, I always think about it on Good Friday. I always think about it on the 13th. And then yesterday, the 20th was his birthday. So he would have been 76 this year and uh or maybe 75 no he would have been 75 he would have been 75 no 76 anyway uh so he anyway so the whole grief thing it's really raw at the moment and then yesterday on his birthday uh there was news that both my uncle Larry has got fourth stage cancer and that's what they've named it in my mum as well. So it just sort of makes St. Paddy's Day that bit more stressful, April a bit more stressful with all the with all the uh, with all the dates. So this is going to be about grief and sorry I didn't mean to unload. I just thought I'd uh, share where I'm coming from. <laughs> okay, back in a sec. <laughs> 